Hey guys, this is Feeding Frenzy 91 and I'm talking about Nintendo. Why? Because remember how I think it was a while back, but I think I made a Nintendo video, right? About how like I think the new Switch the 2023 was the earliest that we'd see the new Switch. Well, apparently we're not going to be seeing it this year, God willing, because a Nintendo I'm not going to go into all the details, uh, but the president of Nintendo basically said that they're not looking to do it this fiscal year, which, which is until April of next year. That's when the fiscal year ends. So that would be the earliest we see a Switch 2. Personally, this is a bit of a stretch because we're already getting to the point where games are only coming out, I believe, for the current gen system, which is the Series X and the uh, PS5. See, Nintendo Switch, I believe, was all right as long as games were still being made for the Xbox One and the PS4. But we're already getting to the point where I think a good amount of the new games, at least, are going to be coming out just current gen, not for the PS4 or the Xbox One. So I doubt they'd be coming out for the Switch. So I really think Nintendo is stretching the Switch's lifespan here because I think they need to get Switch Pro out. But don't rush it. They need to get it to the point where... Third-party devs. It won't even be like a question whether that game is coming to Nintendo's console or not because it's at a level where third-party devs don't have to, I guess, like break their back over bringing it to the Switch. They don't have to really work that hard. Maybe, maybe a little bit harder than for the PS5 and the Xbox Series X, but not that hard, I believe. I believe that should be a point where these devs, they, come, they can like bring the games on Nintendo without working too hard. So... I really think Nintendo really needs to get that system out, but don't rush it. Make sure that it's where it needs to be that for the generation of the Xbox Series X and the PS5, games aren't going to be that hard to be brought onto Nintendo's console. Because then it could basically last with them and then basically release when the next set come out. Or at least close to when the next set come out. But what do you guys think about this? Do you guys think it's good that it's... Nintendo probably won't be bringing it out till earliest next year. And how much longer do you think the Switch can kind of just coexist with the Series X and with the PS5 even? Let me know in the comments below. Thanks for watching. Like, share, and subscribe. And may God bless you all.